Hello friends, this video shows beta 6 blocks, ozone of autohemotherapy and Mukherjee regime combination for avascular necrosis of hip joint. We know that Mukherjee regime works wonders for hip joint, but addition of ozone autohemotherapy is something which produces very dramatic relief and this video shows the procedure step by step. First we take 1 ml of heparin, the same is injected into an auto hemotherapy bottle which is vacutainer. The bottle has three spots one for injecting ozone that goes through a diffuser, one for transfusing the blood and a small one for injecting the heparin. We draw the blood using a standard drip set and a 19 gauge needle is used to get a vein and you can see that the blood comes out in a rapid gush and one has to wait till 50 milliliters of blood has filled the bottle. The tourniquet is removed and the blood is allowed to flow in the bottle. Now we take a 50 cc latex free syringe and we are using 1 by 8 of a liter of oxygen to produce a 70 microgram per liter concentration of ozone. This ozone is now pushed into the blood and by the vacuum action it goes through the diffuser and you can see the bubbling of the ozone and the blood becoming cherry red. This is patient's own blood which has been ozonized and has got a plethora of applications. Using a venflon, we are going to retransfuse this blood and the transfusion set is rubber free and ozone compatible. You can see that we push the needle to the right spot, all air is evacuated and we are attaching it to the venflon so that we are able to transfuse the blood at 40 to 45 drops per minute. This is important that we do not very rapidly transfuse the blood and you can see that the color of the blood that is being transfused has changed from the venous blood to cherry red. As the blood ozonated blood is being transfused, we embark upon the process of giving bilateral beta 6 blocks. Beta 6 blocks are given one finger breadth or one centimeter away from the neurovascular bundle and the cocktail includes xylocaine, clonidine, depomedorol and water to ensure that the concentration of xylocaine is 0.5 percent, not more than 10 ml, not more than 1 milligram of steroid and not more than 30 micrograms of clonidine are used. 
once these blocks are done and the auto hemotherapy transfusion is complete the patient can be made to walk and run immediately and he says that he has never walked so briskly in the last 45 to 50 days since his hip avian was diagnosed if you are interested in doing an ozone prolotherapy course please message the number given before thank you